Righto, well, um, unusual place to do a bush cooking segment, uh, but not really that unusual, hey Nick? <laughs> We've been playing with the truck in the workshop here, and it's lunchtime. And this is a really good opportunity, actually, to show you something completely different in one sense, but really, really simple in another sense. Mate, I don't know if you're going to like this. Do you like strong flavours? Yeah, yeah. Hey? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. Here's how it goes. Uh, cooked these earlier. They're just standard old hot dogs. I'm real keen to see what you think of this because it's a little different. Now, this is sauerkraut. Have you ever had sauerkraut? Sauerkraut, no. Yeah, no. oh man. A lot of Aussies don't get into sauerkraut. I never did for years. I do now because it's really good for you. It's just pickled cabbage, right. basically. It's um, it's a German thing, so it goes really good with beer. But we can't do that yet. We'll have to <laughs> no, no, no. Save that till the end of the day. That's sauerkraut. So there's some strong flavours in this. Mm -hmm. This is Swiss cheese, which I grated myself, which is why it's all stuck together. <laughs> and then this, and this is, as you can see, this is looking like being a weird hot dog because this is. Thousand Island dressing, which you normally get on your prawns yep, down yep, at the yep. RSL Club. Okay, so I'll just give it a decent hit of that. So what we got there is sauerkraut, Swiss cheese, and Thousand Island dressing right. on a conventional hot dog. I'll just tap that down for you, and you tell me what that tastes like. Mm. Not bad. It's not bad, is it? That's it pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> hey, if he reckons it's pretty good, that's really good. That means maybe my bar work will stick together. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm going to feed the rest of the crew now. We'll get them over. You're probably wondering how come I've um, downgraded to a 60 series. <laughs> no, I haven't at all. Uh, Milo's in bits at the moment, and we're working on Milo too. And the yellow truck's not here today. So uh, we've got the old 61 perfect weapon for a little bit of bush cooking, especially in a car park. Looks good to me. There you go. Lovely. You watch this. There you go Andrew, give that a go mate. You might never work in the workshop again. Hopefully not because you're dead. That's sauerkraut, can you taste that? Mm. It's strong isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Cause there's, nice, no, nice. there's no taste in a dog. You add the taste to a hot dog. <laughs> That's what we did. Hey, has anyone seen manager Nick? No, he's ducked off has he? He probably thought he, ah, there he is. You thought you'd get away with this, didn't you? Come on, mate. So far. <laughs> were you there when I did that cook up up the top of Land Cruiser Park? You were, weren't you? Yes, I was. Yeah. You know, no one died after that. It's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> Miracle. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Give that a go, mate. Appreciate it. All right. See if you last past lunchtime. <laughs>